January 27, 2015, marked the 70th anniversary of the liberation of Auschwitz. The Holocaust Memorial Center commemorated International Holocaust Remembrance Day with screenings of the award-winning documentary, Watchers of the Sky. Civic Center TV visited the Berman Center of the Performing Arts to remember the past with members of the West Bloomfield community. Today on the International Holocaust Remembrance Day, uh, this marks the 70th anniversary of the liberation from Auschwitz. So certainly the Holocaust Center um, has scheduled uh, two showings of Watchers of the Sky here at the Berman Theater in, this morning and uh, in the evening at the Holocaust Center in Farmington Hills. Today we're showing the film Watchers of the Sky, which is a feature-length documentary that follows the story of Raphael Lemkin, a Polish Jewish lawyer who was active in trying to legislate internationally against the crime of barbarity, which became known as genocide. Raphael Lemkin emigrated from Europe before the Holocaust, and he spent the duration of the Holocaust inventing the structure that became the international legal um, framework for prosecuting genocide. Lemkin's life was spent attempting to find a way to prosecute these crimes, which eventually resulted in the, in the tribunal at The Hague, which is where we prosecute crimes against humanity. His efforts have led to the ability to prosecute such individuals who have murdered innocent people, innocent men, women, and children. The important thing about this, and the reason we show this film today, is because we want to stress the importance of action, not just learning from history, but doing something about it. We know that since the Holocaust, over a hundred million people have been murdered, men, women, children, as a result of genocide, politicide, and the slave trade. That's one human being since 1945, every 19 seconds. That is a number that's impossible to comprehend. For us to stand aside is not acceptable. For us to watch what's going on while others are murdered, innocents are killed, is not acceptable. It is our duty as human beings. It is certainly our duty as Americans in this free country to see that it does not take place, to see that people who may be very different from us, who may be very far away from us, are still us. And it is up to each of us, it is up to each of you, to see that this does not happen again. The world collectively recites, never again, and simultaneously watches as genocide occurs with haunting frequency. It is essential to acknowledge these past and current atrocities, however difficult it may be. In an area as diverse as West Bloomfield Township, when we joined together to remember the past, we set the groundwork to make a brighter future and ensure that never again becomes a reality.